sunshine and blue skies. Perfect day for college baseball as we get set for game two. Liam Doyle to the mound, and he's been really good since he's been inserted into the starting rotation. No question, Richard. He has been a difference maker. Weekend guy right here before the SEC season started, and certainly that's continued. You're going to see a true power left-handed pitcher today. That fastball radar gun's going to show 90, 92, 93. Hitters are going to tell you he's throwing harder than that. He is very difficult. Only one home run allowed this year. This is a chopper to third, and it's over the glove of Daly. Hill hits the bag at third. He'll come around to score. Fisher goes first to third. An RBI single with a big bouncing ball from Jackson Ross, and the Rebels strike first. 1-1 pitch to Leger. He lifts it into the outfield. McCarthy moving toward the gap. He will run it down. That's a sacrifice fly for Ethan Leger. Picks up his 29th run of the year. And this ball lifted out to right field. That falls fair in front of Trace and Hughes. He'll send it in toward the plate. 3-0 pitch. And that one missed. That's four in a row. Third walk of the inning. Fourth free pass. Kentucky ties the game. 1-1. This ball hit to second. Chance for two. Hill able to step on the bag. And that is a huge double play for Liam Doyle and Ole Miss. Out into right field, that's going to fall in for a base hit, and Kentucky takes a 3-2 lead. Still nobody out in the top of the third inning. This ball hit to second. That should get home another run, and the Kentucky Wildcats now lead it 4-2 on the RBI ground out from Nolan McCarthy. Lifts the ball to left field. Leger going back, and he's going to watch that one leave the yard. A two-run home run for Nolan McCarthy, his second of the year. Kentucky hangs a four spot here in the top of the third inning. And the Wildcats lead it by four. Now in front, six to two. Lift it out into center field for Groff. For the wind blowing that ball, kind of playing havoc with it. Sacrifice fly. Kentucky now leads seven to two. Spinning a throw to second. Ole Miss has got Burks picked off. He'll run into the tag at third base. Gatlin off the end of the bat, a roller to short, fielded by Smith, throws across in time. That gets a run home. Gatlin picks up the RBI, and Groff goes to third. Well, this has gotten one here in the fourth. And Hughes lines it out into right field, a base hit. An RBI single for Trace and Hughes. He does drive that run in his first time up. He hits this one out into right center field. There's the first hit off a of lefty for Braden Randall. Coming around to score is Trayson Hughes. Randall into second base with an RBI double, and Ole Miss's offense has got some life. Out to right field. McCoy makes the catch. Throw comes to the infield. A sacrifice fly for Luke Hill, and it's now 7-6. to six. Hold on to home field if you're Ole Miss. Out to left field. And Leger runs out of real estate. That's an opposite field home run for James McCoy. He got that ball up, and it looked like it just rode the wind. It was like a cut shot into the left field bullpen. 3-1 pitch. This one's hit high in the air to left field. Waldschmidt going back, and this time it's Ole Miss. It maybe gets a little bit of help from the win. Ethan Groff with a home run, his fifth of the year. That was a moonshot to left. Uh, it's an offensive day. You get that ball up in the air, you give yourself a chance. Golf had good backspin on that. Got it way up in the air and ultimately was a no doubt of the left. McCarthy has had a big day. He's driven in three runs. He hits this one in the air to right field. Trayson Hughes goes back and that ball over the wall. A home run, the second of the game for Nolan McCarthy. That is a three run blast and Trayson Hughes is still down in right field. Smith dancing around out at second. Boy, jammed him. That's a drop in base hit. Walt Schmidt going to come around to score an RBI single. Chops it to the right side. Nicholson with a little short hop, and they say he got the tag and is out at first base. Run comes home to score, so Will Fur Furness scores.
out to left field. Leger going back. It's to the track, reaches up, and that's another home run for Kentucky. Emilian Petrie hits his fourth of the season. That moves him into a tie. Ground ball left side. Chance for two to second for one to first. Not in time. Looking for the double play. Did not get the call from first place umpire Scott Klein. Grant Smith. Runners go. Out into left field, a base hit. Grant Smith with a hit in the nine hole. This ball hit high into the air for to left field, and Jackson Ross has a home run. That ball was hit a ton. Seventh home run of the year for Jackson Ross. Yeah, off-speed pitch up, and Jackson Ross really has just hit the entire season. Hammers this one to deep left field. Fly ball to right field. McCoy shading his eyes, fighting that sky in the sun a little bit, makes the catch, and that ends this game.